Hi guys, this is the hardest video I've ever had to make, but please watch it all the way through because I need your help to save a life, especially if you're in the medical profession dealing with cancer as we need your advice. If you watch my past videos like Ark Ragnarok, The Forest, SnowRunner etc, you would have seen me play with my best friend Muspa. In fact he's more than a friend, I see him as my little brother. Muspa roughly means light in Arabic and he lights up my life. It can get lonely and depressing at times staying in all day and night making videos, but he cheers me up with his joy, fun and energy. He's not been able to make videos for his own channel for a while as it doesn't pay enough to live on, but we were all set to start shooting videos again together in a new year. We had planned on playing the survival game Green Hell together, Rust PvP and many others, on top of my normal ARC videos. We had everything ready and set up, but then he was hit with some terrible news. His mother has been diagnosed with cancer of the spine, multiple myeloma. She's had osteoporosis, brittle bone there for a while, and has a crushed vertebrae. She recently got COVID that caused blood clots in her legs. Please stay safe guys as I didn't even know it could do that. She had a blood test and find high levels of protein in the blood. Then the doctors did a fish test to take a bone marrow sample, which confirmed cancer. As you can imagine, this news is devastating to Musper and his family. Not only because he might lose his mother to cancer, but because he's already had to watch his father slowly die of cancer when he was younger. Then he lost his little sister due to a pointless medical mistake. Then he lost a beloved uncle who helped him out after his father's death. So this is a fourth agony he's had to go through. His mother was the only one who got him through it and gave him hope. Now she might be taken away from him and his younger brothers, leaving him with no one. This is too much sorrow for anyone to bear. Even living with so much tragedy in his life after losing his father, little sister and uncle, I was amazed he still managed to carry on and make some cheerful times in his life for himself and us. Oh, come on, back. He's coming back. Run, back to me, back to me, quick. Both of them are coming for you! <laughs> oh, it's you, it's you! Yeah, it's me! Must be back to the trap! And you! Quick! I'm back! I try! Oh shit, must be. Oh shit, must be. Let's go Save the trap, catch me! Oh shit! <laughs> really? <laughs> really? <laughs> I got one of them down. I cannot move! Come help me! It's okay, must be, as long as he's eating you and not me. Help me! <laughs> Help me! You trap catch me, you stupid! Oh, uh, he's got this down. Oh my that? god! Oh, oh my god! Help okay. me! I cannot move. Okay, it's been a while since I've used traps, and I forgot you could catch yourself. <laughs> What's that? I hope you. Just pull me down that mountain, Musper. Pull me down the mountain. <laughs> Musper, get in front of me and pull me all the way down there. To see that box down there? Pull. No, oh, you didn't kill. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing driving that. Amazing. Musper, I called you to help me, not make things worse. <laughs> Tell me to help you, Steve! No, come help your brother! No, it's completely no. useless ever! <laughs> Steve, please, uh, recover your track and give me your track again. That must be gone now. All his happiness and joy is gone. Weeks of despair have left him emotionally dead inside with nothing but pain and sadness. And he's just trying to get by day by day with extreme depression. Nothing in his life gives him joy anymore, and I don't know if the old Muspa will ever return. Muspa's a proud, private young man who wouldn't ask for help, but I'm asking it for him. He didn't even tell his closest friends about his mother, as he didn't want to trouble them or get them down. So I told them, because he needs his friends around him to get him through this. Muspa's a lovely, kind person who's got a heart of gold, and is somebody who loves and cares a great deal, but the downside of that is the pain he feels is so much worse. If he could take his mother's cancer from her body to his, he would. If he could die to save her, he would. He would do anything to help her, anything to make her well. 
So in this terrible time for him, he needs our support and help. I've started a GoFundMe for Musper's mother to start raising funds right away. I don't know how long it will take to raise the money, or find a better place for specialised or alternative treatment if there are any. The link to the GoFundMe page is on screen and in the description box below. I don't want him to worry about money as he has enough to deal with. I want him to be able to spend time with his mother and look after her. So funds raised will go towards three areas. The first is everyday stuff. I want Musba to buy his mother anything she needs to make her comfortable. You've seen a crushed vertebra and that must be extremely painful. If he needs to get her a support chair or bed, I want him to be able to. We want her to eat well and to keep healthy as long as possible. So he can buy her good healthy foods and whatever medicine she needs to keep well. He's been spending all his savings on her and he doesn't have much left. Second, his mother's biggest wish is to see Musba marry so he's not alone and has a future. As it's something we can make happen now, I want us to fulfil her wish to see her son married, and hopefully see her grandchildren. In their culture, the mother sorts out a wedding and deals with a bride, and without her, it's likely that him and his younger brothers will not get married or have a future, and the family would collapse. So I'm adding that to the goal as it will make his mother happy and keep her spirits up. I think it would give Musper something to look forward to and take his mind off everything for a while and give him something good in his life and hope for the future. And third, then of course to Musper's mother's treatment. I'm reading all I can on this form of cancer and trying to find any new treatments that can cure her or prolong a life longer than normal. So if there are any medical professionals watching this who are in the field of cancer treatment, can you please contact me and let me know of all the best possible or alternative treatments you know about, or even any new experimental ones we could try for multiple myeloma. Hopefully there's a treatment out there that can cure her, and if there is, please please let me know who to contact. Hopefully we will raise enough money to be able to send her anywhere in the world to get the best possible treatment. I just need to know who to contact and where, and I'll pass that information on to Musper and his mother's doctors. Until then, his mother will get the standard treatment. Musper is a good, kind and helpful person. He's one of the good guys, but his reward for that is life keeps being sadistically cruel to him. He lives a few years, then somebody in his family he loves gets sick and dies. A few years later, another loved family member dies. Then a few more years and somebody else gets sick and dies. And now on top of all that, his mother gets cancer. To lose your father to cancer is bad enough. To lose your little sister on top of that is tragic. Then you loved uncle. But for your mother to get cancer as well is a sick, twisted, cruel amount of agony no one should ever experience. And I'll do anything I can to help and support him to have a better future. He told me at this point that just living feels like an endless cycle of torture with everyone he loves dying, and nothing good ever happening. Now his mother getting cancer is beyond the limit of what he can take, it's just heartbreaking. So, please try help us to break that cycle of torture. Please go to the GoFundMe page which is on screen in the description below, and give what he can spare so he can look after his mother. Also, please try and help me to get the word out to spread Musper's story to everyone you know. Tell all your friends and ask them to tell all their friends. Tell every YouTuber and influencer you watch. Ask them to link this video or the GoFundMe page to their social media and hopefully this will go viral. Please help me get this message out to help Musper's mother. So please give what you can spare and if you can't then please subscribe to his YouTube channel and watch a few vids so he gets a little ad money. Before all this he decided to try and make it as a full time YouTuber but now I don't know if he'll ever recover. And of course all his attention is focused on looking after his mother and everything else has just faded away. Again please donate what you can spare and if you're religious please pray for Musper's mother that she will be well and have a long life. Thank you for your help and support guys, it really means a lot to us. Please help him out of his living hell.